guys and welcome back to VW Farm. I'm Darren and today we're having a look at our, our Oval Beetle. What we're going to be having a look at is this bulkhead. This is really rusty, it's all gone. But luckily we do have a new part. We have the base. So this needs welding in. It's actually quite solid and quite thick luckily. So I think what we need to do first of all, we're going to lift the whole chassis over onto its side so we can take a closer look. So let's get into it. Well So we've got this flipped over now, and in more closer inspection, it seems to be in more pieces, because there's the centre piece going across there, which is laid across the spine. There's the front of the chassis there, which is really thick, and there's like these wings, which are really thin. And this centre part is absolutely solid. So I'm actually thinking of just cutting these sections out and literally cut, using this as parts and cutting this part up to refit in. Well, that's them back parts cut out. So now we'll have to make some kind of a template to recut the new part out. So we've got the part in the vise now. Looks, he's just going to cut the panel for the part that we need. So the first fitment is getting there, but it does need some more off. So come on then Lucas, decide where you need to cut. Well, the first cut we're going to do is straight along there and straight down to get this piece off. Let's get to that. Very nice. Definitely get in there. So Lux has cut that part out so far. I'll see if I can get this welded in. There we go, it's getting there. Still needs a little bit of trimming, I think. So we've got the two holes there. And what actually came out was this piece. So before I forget, I'm going to cut the plate off and weld that one in position. So I think that stops the 
underneath from squashing when you fit the bolts. Lovely job. So I just need to clean this part up now. Tack that into there. So as I've welded this part in, unfortunately just on the inside, a little part of the weld has come through. So I'm going to have to drill that out. So obviously we need a straight through hole. And that little weld will just catch on the bolts. Brilliant, that's all clear now. So it's just a case of getting the plate on the top now. So I've this plate cut out now, all sanded up, ready for welding. So let's get this one welded in. So I just hold it with a G clamp and hopefully it should stay where it where it is. So well done now, cleaned up. So now on to the other side. We've got the other part tacked on now, so all that's left to do is weld it up and clean up the welds with the grinder and the sander. So I'm really happy how this has gone, so we've got the floor pans in and this is all solid now, looking good. I think the next thing we need to do is take this axle off and rebuild that. So I think that will be the his next job. So please give us a like and a subscribe and we'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.